lot of worries uh, continue to grow in Rio de Janeiro. That's the site of the Olympics in 2016. At issue, pollution and the city's bay. It's the staging area for the sailing events. And as CCTV's Lucretia Franco tells us, the dirty water was on display during a visit by inspectors from the International Olympic Committee. It is a grim sight. Floating debris from the peninsula in one of the waterways that leads to the Guanabara Bay, some 10 kilometers from the starting point for the 2016 Olympic sailing events. Mario Moscatelli, an independent biologist who has been monitoring pollution in Rios Bay for more than 18 years, says the city's waters are not suitable for the games. Então hoje. We have now practically all the rivers that flow into the Guanabara Bay transformed into ditches of garbage and sewage, and all that water inside the bay has huge volumes of debris. The Guanabara Bay is one of Rio's most famous postcard views, but it's heavily polluted. Officials have vowed to treat 80% of the sewage by the time of the Games, that will take place in just 18 months. Water pollution has become a major hazard for Rio de Janeiro ahead of the Olympic Games. But a team of international Olympic inspectors visiting venues believes the city will meet its promises. We, we want um, every single venue to be in a, uh, ready for the athletes to compete in a secure and safe manner. And we still confirm because we have been given the reassurance that um, all the venues will be met, uh, will, will meet um, uh, the level of uh, uh, sustainability and environment, um, uh, environmentally respected the uh, aspect so that athletes can compete uh, again in a safe and secure uh, manner. While local officials say 50% of the sewage in Rio is now being treated, not only the bay, but the lagoon where canoeing and rowing will take place is visibly polluted. The International Olympic Games inspectors say it is too soon to judge. We, we are like, like athletes in this. We are pushing towards the finish line, and we should respect that. Every effort is being made at that point in time, and 80% remain the commitment. It better be true, biologists warn, for the sake of the health of sailing teams and other water sports athletes that are already testing venues. Sick competitors is the last thing Rio needs as it gets ready to host the first Olympic Games in South America. Lucrecia Franco, CCTV, Rio de Janeiro.